How's it going guys? Day 2? Day 2 Hardcore. Now, we're going to start this adventure off down here at Balloa Airstrip. Now we're in a very, very tough position here. I did in fact find an M4 as we continued our journey on the hunt for the people that hid my body. Um, but unfortunately we didn't find them. But that wasn't to worry. Considering we did find the M4, which is right here. And we found quite a lot for it, so we're, we're all set really, aren't we? We're all good and ready to go. Now, we're going to completely dump the SKS, but I do in fact want everything off it. It's just so we can carry one gun and stuff, and uh, hopefully get through this a lot easier than expected. And I don't feel safe, guys. I really, really don't feel safe right now. We're on a 40 player server. Of hardcore. <laughs> this is not gonna end too well. I just know it. You know when you just have one of them bad feelings? That's what I've got right now. This is not gonna end too well for me. So we need to really go on a hunt. We've got the water. But we need more food by the looks of things. We're slacking on food, guys. Do we have any hidden away? Well, in fact, we do. So. Let's get down here behind these rocks real quick. And uh, let's go see if we can find any friendlies. But you and I both know this is not going to end well. Yeah, so we, we're doing okay. I mean, we got a lot of ammo. We've still got our long range scopes and stuff. Um, for the Mosin, whenever we can grab one of them. Um, are you gonna finish this cereal? That's the only problem I seem to have with um, these sort of servers is they're just so laggy and unresponsive. I love that drink all function now throughout this update. But yeah, we're gonna head back up to Berezino, um, see what we can find along the way, and then maybe we're gonna head to the new town. I still haven't thought of a nickname for the new town, and guys, we still haven't given our player a name. So, that's something we've really got to look into doing. Come on, drink it. We know he's finished. There we go. I have drank all the canteen. He's still thirsty, so... It's going to be difficult. Life's going to be difficult. But we should get there. We should be okay. Let's go find some friendly buddies. Maybe that we can team up with. Now there should be a heli crash right somewhere over there. We're going to stay in the tree line also. We're more camoed there than what we are over on that beach. So this is definitely the place that we want to be. So we've got handcuffs, got keys, we've got everything that we could possibly need to survive this apocalypse. Now what we will do, is we will in fact eat these tins real quick of peaches. Now say we eat them because they're good for food and water, seeing as they're fruit, they do get you hydrated pretty quick. And we've just drunk 100 milliliters, 100 liters, I don't know what they class it as, 100% water bottle. So let's just sit here. Hopefully we don't get sniped in the back. The new breathing function they brought in when you're aiming down sight and you're out of breath is just awful. I mean the gun just bounces here, there and everywhere. We're starting to come into Cherno, I think. Yeah, we're, we're starting to slowly make our way into Cherno, so we're going to switch sides. As I'm going to be running for the centre of Cherno. And them kind of peaches made us go hydrated. That's exactly what we needed. This could be a good day, guys. Could be a good day. 
until we get shot at. Someone's definitely been here. Door has been opened. So do you think? Do you think we should run guns drawn? I know people seem to think that you're more hostile if you already have your gun out. But then, if we're getting in a gunfight, we need to be able to uh, shoot back as quickly as possible. Something doesn't feel right about here. Something really doesn't. Mm. You know, like when you just get them spinal chills. It's exactly what I'm getting right now. This doesn't feel good. Could just be someone pouncing around one of these houses. And all it takes is one shot. One shot, and we're in a bad position. That's why we have to get the first shot on someone else. Then they back off. As they back off, we go in. We're moving like predators. Let's pounce on them. Oh, these people are seriously about searching places, isn't they? You may eventually make a campfire. We've got the axe to get the, the fire logs, but we still need a pickaxe. Maybe we can find someone that's got one that's willing to help us out. I'm trying to get one of my friends on. Friends? Why the hell did I say it like that? But yeah, I'm trying to get one of my friends on. Hardcore. And that way we can have a bit of fun. I feel a lot more safe when there's two of us, you know. Two eyes are always better than one. Someone has done this place over well and truly good. I mean, everything has just been looted. Apart from these few buildings up here. Me and Cherno don't get along. Where do we go around here? really trying to be careful of anyone like lurching and waiting. Can we get out over there? Yeah, right, here we go. A lot of people just tend to go up there and snipe. There's something we've really got to look out for and if we Oh my god, play up, play up, play up, play up, play up, play up. He looks okay. Should we go speak to him? See what he's up to. So we just carry on our adventure. I mean, we haven't seen anyone since day one. But this is my first person that we're gonna see. I think he's gone. There he is. We had his axe out. Is that a zombie? Yeah, that's a zombie. Oh my god, my heart's racing already. Where did he go? There he is. It's like playing a game of Ring Around the Roses. Hey, man. Friendly? Friendly. Friendly. Yeah. You're the first person I've come across in a while. Whoa, what are you doing with that X? <laughs> wrong way on the Oh. <laughs> uh, where about you heading then? Uh, I don't know really. I was just going around it the first time I visited the city. Oh, uh, yeah. I was following you for quite some time. We was having a game of like Ring Around the Roses. <laughs> uh, you playing alone? Uh, yeah, I'm alone. Oh yeah, the same as that. Just don't want like someone coming in and shooting us in the back. <laughs> Ready? Uh, what's that? You said there was somebody that was following. No, no, no. I'm just making sure that no one is there. <laughs> Just so it gives me time to pull out the gun. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm lucky you didn't kill me. 
<laughs> but yeah, I'll let you go anyway. I'm going to head up to Berezino, hopefully get in a gunfight and kill some people. <laughs> Alright man, speak in a bit. Oh, nice guy. Scared me a little, I'm not going to lie. He did scare me a little. The first thing i done, as you noticed, I went and checked his pulse. You have to know, he, he said he was playing alone, but one war in Daisy, never trust anybody. We're going to head up to Bandit Mountain, we're going to head to that cave, and we're going to have a rest. It's a lovely day in the world of Chernobyl, or whatever you want to call it. I don't really give a shit what you want to call it. Oh, I know, it reminds me of like, somewhere like Czech Republic. <laughs> That's where we want to go. We want to go up between them trees. We need to head up in between them trees. And go sit in the cave. Now if we had a pickaxe, we could have made the fire as well while we was here. We could have collected the eight the bits of stone that we need. And then we could have got just chopped down the tree from up there for the two fire logs. So we could have just sat around the fire and told fight camp stories. We saved that for another day. We saved that for day four or five, maybe. And I'll try and get a few of my mates onto hardcore. It's gonna be difficult because they will have no weapons. Unless they can find a Mosin, then by all means, go ahead and they've got some gear for it. Or I'll swap them the Mosin for the M4. But most of the people I play with, they all tend to like the snipe and stuff. Very good sniping shots. Every single one of them. It's a big ass mountain. Let's go all the way up. No one's behind us, thank fuck. And here we are. We're in the cave. This is such a good place. Maybe we can sit there and have a campfire. Let's chop down this tree real quick. It doesn't work for me. It just really, really doesn't. Why don't you work? Oh. Look, guys, it just refuses to work for me. How about you? Yeah, it just, it just it's never worked for me. But check out that view. Look at that, that is just beautiful. See like the other mountains in the background to our right. It's is such a good place. Now I don't condemn, well, I don't really want snipers heading to this point and just killing anyone that's coming through. Mm. Play fair guys, don't camp and snipe. I mean we could all do that at one point, because you never know, karma's a bitch. And when you try and hit down, you could end up breaking your legs along the way. And that would be funny and you would deserve it. But yeah, so we're just going to go back a little. And we're going to eat some food. We still haven't even actually checked out the M4 real quick. Look at that. That's such a beautiful gun. Looks so good. Shame about the silence is still not working. I love the bullets that you can see them chambered in as well. I wonder if they actually move out of the gun when you're shooting. Should we give it a quick try? Or mm, no, we shouldn't. We don't really have the ammo. But yeah, so let's take a few drinks. And then we'll carry on our adventure. Up east to Berezino.